Hello everyone, welcome back. Today we're playing Super Mario Land. We're gonna start this awesome Game Boy game. I'm not playing right now, this is the demo. <laughs> but yeah, that's what the game looks like. So, Super Mario Land. I am planning on playing all the Super Mario Lands, one, two, and three. But we're gonna start with the first one. So uh, let's start with World 1-1. One, one. Um, let me... There. I, I would love to hear the music too, Mario, you know. So I had to um, turn on the volume a little bit. Now, there are a couple of things, like pipes, that you can go into. This game was made in the past <laughs> after Super Mario Brothers for the NES. Um, also, this oh, whoops, this game wasn't supervised by uh, Shigeru Miyamoto, the man behind Mario, the one that invented Mario. It was, I think it was invi um, invented or made by uh, uh, Gunpai Yokoi. Not really sure if that, that's true, but it's the name that comes to mind. Uh, Gunpai Yokoi is actually, or Yokoi, Gunpai, I never know. If I mispronounce the name, that's because I did look it up. I'm not a, not a, I'm currently not fact checking. Currently, I'm just playing this game. Um, but he did invent the Game Boy itself. But I do know for a fact that this game wasn't made by the same team that was responsible for Super Mario Brothers on the NES with Shigeru Miyamoto as a lead developer and uh, designer thing. Yeah, so that's why it's it's different. There's similar type of enemies like Goombas here, and um, there's also Koopa Troopers, but once you uh, drop on their heads, they turn into bombs. I don't know what kind of animal this was. Also don't know why I jumped on him, because I clearly whoop, had a um, had a star. Uh, but yeah, also that's the reason why the music is different, items are different, and we have reached the end of World 1-1. So I'm gonna go into that door, and that's when we're gonna say goodbye.